Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and a question that I had about Google Chrome is um, a, a viewer that is unable to cast on a smart TV uh, when he wants to see web pages but he, see, he says that sometimes there are things that can cast and he doesn't quite understand why. So smart TVs come in a lot of different configurations and settings and systems. There's no real big standard, so everybody just is doing what they want. So if you buy a Samsung TV, a TCL TV, or whatever TV, a Sony, um, what you get at some point is each system has its own features. And that will impact what you can actually cast from the browser. In my case here, I've got two smart TVs. I've got a 65-inch Samsung. I've got a 50-inch uh, or 55-inch TCL. Now, one of them is, of course, Samsung proprietary operating system. And so what happens is that system can cast some stuff, mainly videos. Some um, web pages, like from Google Chrome, will not work. Um, and it depends a lot on so many different features and depending on what you use as software. But here, the question mostly concerns Chrome. So um, the other one that I have, a TCL, is actually a TV that has a Chromecast integrated within the TV. And so it's, of course, much easier to cast on a Chromecast device uh, with Google Chrome because it's made for that. So when I right click on the uh, the screen of a web page, of course you've got the cast option. And what you'll see is when you click on it, what you can cast to and what you cannot. Android TV is my 55 inch TCL. As soon as I click this, I see my screen, this screen on my TV also. And so there is a difference, we see that you know, it, it, it works well and all of that. And, of course, here it shows you stop casting. So you can stop casting. But you see that on my Samsung, it says available for specific video sites. That's because it's not able to cast a web page because of the format and the way that the casting is done within Google Chrome. But if I go to YouTube and say that I would click on YouTube anything that is a let's see the fireplace here so um, of course I'm gonna stop that I'm gonna remove this for a second wait until it starts but when you go to a web page like a YouTube page where video is playing that's where you will actually see that um, there's a, an ability to um, let me just pass this here we go so here we go if I look at it here actually if I look at the casting possibly possibility it now tells me that Samsung Series 7 is available and it's available because video playback is available so that is one of the things so some TVs have limitations some TVs will have the ability to play videos. Some will have the ability to, of course, show a full cast of a full page. If I click here next to the video, um, available, available, because it's going to play just a video. But if I go back to my main page, once again, you'll see that uh, right-clicking and going whoop, on uh, casting again. So let me just click, whoops, click, cast. I lost the cast capability here. There we go. Probably need a, another spot. Here we go. Cast. Got to be careful where you click also because depending on where you click, you're going to have a different menu. So here it says, again, available for specific video sites, but only available on my Android TV because it has a Chromecast integrated. Now, if none is showing, if that says, like, you know, there's nothing showing here, that means that your smart TV might not have the minimum requirements in the features, or it could be your PC that might not be powerful enough. Older PCs might not cast very well. It takes a minimum requirement, a minimum of power to cast 
to smart TVs. So that uh, works on many different browsers, by the way. If you're on Edge and you right click, you'll see that uh, even on Edge, there'll be a, there should be a um, ability to cast somewhere. Yeah, cast media to device, here it is. So if you click on it, it's gonna give you, once again, the same available uh, format. Now, for most browsers, it's going to be the same, meaning what you cast from the browser is going to be either videos on some TVs or full web pages that you can check out on others. So uh, it really depends on your smart TV and the power and the power of your PC. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.